Hello everyone, I'm Brad Errington from Aquila Real Estate and welcome to the agent assisted sale of 12 Hamilton Terrace in Greenmount. A lovely 4x1 home located just down the road from Greenmount Primary School, just down the road from St Anthony's Primary School, close to the bus routes, close to the airport, close to shopping, close to childcare. Really good house, big block, park just over the road, beautiful swing set, um, nice place for your kids to play, a really nice environment in Greenmount. Come with me as we take a tour. Greenmount is an absolutely killer suburb located at the bottom of the Darling Escarp just as you're going up Greenmount Hill. It has the Grayson Highway running up the centre of it, has a really good community feel, really good blocks, really good schools. It's very close to all sort of local amenities in the airport. If you're looking for a lifestyle, come to Greenmount. The home has beautiful established gardens and is located on the high side of the road. And because you're elevated, you have a lovely outlook over the park that's across the road. It has a lovely patio at the front for admiring your front yard and also watching the view across the road. So the home also has a carport which is two cars long and a shade sail out the front which you could easily accommodate a third car. The home has a really good size front lounge room that has a gas bayonet for heating as well and it has a cedar blind in the window with roller shutter and also has the great view over the front yard. So this is their formal dining which is currently set up as their music room. So it would suit, you know, like a six person round table, has a window overlooking the rear patio and then a step down into the main lounge room. What a great kitchen this house has. It has 10 underbench cupboards. It has a bank of five drawers. It has a double sink with double drainers. It has a good sized fridge freezer recess, microwave recess, a relatively new uh, white Westinghouse oven a stainless steel Simpson cooktop. It has seven overhead cupboards, a spice rack, great views over the patio, a granite overlay on the bench, which is a really good feature. And it has a view over the family room and over the dining and the formal dining to the side. Check out how big this family room is at the back of the home. Overlooked by the kitchen, it has a breakfast bar stepping down from the kitchen here, enough space for three chairs, sliding door out directly behind here, to the patio, nice, light and bright through here, uh, looking over the backyard. Tiled floor, so pretty easy maintenance. Nice modern colours. It's just a real family friendly feeling home. You would have to see this table in person to know how big it is, but it's 1500 square. Notoriously hard to fit in any dining room. Now this room swallows it up and there's space to spare has a wood heater as well, has a, a nice nook here for a bookcase, has a sliding door to the front hallway to block it off so you can heat this area itself, has ample room here for a buffet. Now this bathroom here has been tastefully renovated as a, a new bath, it has a, a new toilet in here, has a wall hung double vanity, it has two shaving mirrors, it has a lovely shower here with a uh, tilting door and it has an elongated grate on the floor. Quality floor tiles, quality wall tiles, quality chromeware. Everything about this bathroom just screams luxury. So this is the main bedroom of the home. It has a big uh, walk-in robe here with two big mirrored sliding doors. It has a cedar blind, a roller shutter, nice carpets, nice paintwork, a ceiling fan, room for a queen size bed and possibly you might squeeze in a king. Everyone has their junk room. This is the owners, sorry guys, but I just thought I'd show you. This is the fourth bedroom, and it's still a very good size, amply big enough for you know a king single bed and a robe and a, a chest of drawers, or make a great study. So this is bedroom three, nice bright blue for a boy, cedar blind, has a built-in robe, nice study nook here, easy fit a king single bed if need be just a nice bright space. Now this is a, a good size bedroom too, has a triple row, study nook, good views over the back patio, nice carpets, nice paintwork, nice again bright airy feeling bedroom. Listen to that nice tranquil water feature in the background when you're in the patio, just makes the space nice and relaxing the way a patio is meant to be. Entertain your friends out here, you probably get 20 friends under this patio so it's a quite a good size. 
has direct access through to the carport at the front, which makes easy back and forward of people coming and going from a party. They don't have to go through the house. So just to the side here, you've got a big powered workshop and there's a patio right across the back of the home. All the exits and entries to the home have security doors as well. This powered workshop or, or freestanding studio or kids games room or room for another child to sleep or, or you know, turn into a granny flat, no matter which way you look at it, it's going to be damn handy. Imagine how much of an asset this freestanding room is going to be. Imagine putting all your kids' toys in here or putting the pool table in here or, or turning it into a man cave or turning it into your workshop. Whatever you want to use it for, it's going to be a real asset. So being a 1,018 square metres, you've got lots and lots of space in the backyard. But you've got lots of paving to keep the maintenance down. But you've got some nice lawn areas as well and nice retained areas. So you've got good space for your trampoline, good space for your swing set. You've got a space to keep your chooks and have a veggie garden. And around the corner here, you've even got space for the old typical hills hoist. Everyone needs space to put their junk. And this home has two garden sheds. Now the owner would like to thank you for watching the short video of their home today. But should you need further information, please click on online tool one for a full interactive floor plan of the property. Or should you want to know what you're buying in the house room by room, please click on online tour two for a full spec list of the home. Or should you wish to view the property, please contact me, Brad Errington 0403 929 585.